Hello everybody, this is Tim with TD Sports Cards. Uh, today we're going to be opening up a box of 1997 Tops Series 1 Baseball. It's got the, this set's got this, the Willie Mays inserts, the Mickey Mantle inserts. Um, series 2 has, has an autograph. I'll do a box of that later. Um, as a possible autograph of Derek Jeter commemorating the Rookie of the Year. But... Um, and this box, though, has, uh, you're looking for the inserts, uh, graded in PSA 10, they go anywhere between 30 to 60 bucks, typically. Um, like I said, I do a lot of grading, so, um, some of the other key cards in this set is number 13, the Derek Jeter. Um, that's actually a pretty, pretty good card. Um, Jackie Robinson, this is a 50th year anniversary commemorative set. Um, so his number 40, card number 42 is Jackie Robinson. So that's one you're looking for. Um, and then a series two has Griffey Jr., Cal Ripken, and the best rookie out of this class, um, the best card to get for rookie is number, card number 479. It's got Eric Chavez, um, with Adam Eaton, the rookie. Uh, but the main thing is looking for the inserts. I think get two or three in the, in each box. Uh, and then obviously it just depends on which one you get. But uh, I know there's one that has a, a group of the has Mantle, May or Mantle, Maris, I think, um, or Mantle and Maze or something like that. Or it's like two, it has two or three players on the one card. That one's kind of like the most sought after. Um, and all the foils, the finest, and uh, refractors are all in the series, too. So that will be a good box to open. I got one of those I'll open uh, here in the next week or two. But other than that, we're going to get into this and see what we pull out. Um, and then, obviously, you got your basic Hall of Famers. Um, you know, you're going to have Bonds, Griffey, uh, Sandberg, um, Ripken, and there's there's probably about 15 20 of them in here um it was a good group during that during the late 80s and in the 90s that uh eventually would be in the hall of fame or are in the hall of fame already so we're gonna let's rip this open see what we get and let's rock and roll a sealed box. I bought it off eBay. Um, somebody recommended it. It's in really good shape. So, yeah, we'll just do this and do the classic flip a rooney kind of deal. Look for that. So, as you can see, the packs are foil and they're in really good shape. Um, so, see what we can pull, guys. I'm excited. I said do a lot of grading, so hopefully you can get that stick in. Packs are a little, that's the tight foil. So it might be a little slow. It's 24 packs in a box. Alright, so let's see what we get here. Eh, not too, not bad at all. So see this basic white border design. Um, this is Chuck Noll Block. He was actually pretty good. He got the yips later on in his career, though. Um, and then it's got the different color inner border, you could say. But yeah, there's a Ricky. That's one of my boys. One of my all-time favorite players, Julian Tavares. Ah, another Ricky. That's kind of weird. St. Pat, Daryl Hamilton, there's a Bogsy. Ooh, what do we got? Albert Bell, look at that. It's called the Sweet Strokes. Isn't that pretty cool? Sweet Strokes, Sweet Strokes. Kind of got a, like, a speckle, um, kind of a design to it. As you can see it. 
but it's pretty cool. That's the back. So that's it. I'll see. Good one after that. Good insert. And we got Bob Tukes, Mark Loretta, Charlton, Steinbach, Eric Hansen, David Wells, Paul Wilson, DeMonico, and somebody just emailed me. <laughs> All right, let's go pack two. Let's see what we get. All right, up the bat. Turtle, Hoyles, there's a Sheffield, another Hoyles, so it's like duplicating that first and third card. Now block, there's an Oral Hershiser, Hall of Fame, Mr. McGuire, ah, here we go. This isn't, this isn't card number 42, but this is a good one. Mantle hits 42nd homer for crown. That's a pretty cool card. And that one is pretty nicely centered. Maybe a hair off top to bottom. But it's a pretty cool card. That's one of the ones we're looking for. Yep, here's a highlights. John Mabry. He had a good career for a while. Uh, there's Joe Carter. If Miss World Series home run, Flowers. There's Juan Gone. Francis Cordova. Michael Lieberthal. Mel Rojas. And these are the part of the diamond or the rookie cards they had. They had them in duels and triples, if I remember right. Uh, Nick Bureau and Kevin Sweeney. <laughs> so it's kind of like a common. There were, this wasn't really a good quirky class at all. Maybe this one feels thicker. So Jeter is the main autograph. There are other ones in this, but they're all in series two. There are some, uh, I think, maze autographs you can, that you could get. There's Botelico. So I think about tops. I like switching their cards. Matt Meisk, Fernando Vina, Matt Meisk. Jason Giambi, what we want to see is get the Jeter on the first card and Jeter on the third card. That'd be nice. Gary Gaetti, Eric Goins. I'm sure it's happened somewhere in some of these boxes. Oh, there we go. Yankees power hitters. I like it on this. It's got the little gold foil right there. The Yankees power hitters, Mantle and, and Yogi Berra. Pretty cool. This one is off-centered. Top to bottom. A little bit left to right, but more top to bottom. Um, so as you can see right there. So that one might not be as gradable as the other one. There's Edgar Renteria. Had a good career in coaches now. Eric Hansen. Scott Carl. Jeff Brantley. Mark Loretta. I think he coaches now too. Otis Nixon. I used to like Otis Nixon back with the Braves. Troy Percival. Yeah, him. I went to school with him. It's kind of funny. Alright, and we have Jorge Fabregas. Fabregas. There's a couple guys I went to school with. Back then, um, the guys was Colburn. You know, playing with the Marlins, came with the Expos, um, the Marlins World Series, and they won it. So it was pretty cool. Old history. Got Jason Giambi, Sean Green, Benito Santiago, Sean Green again, Darren Fletcher, Rusty Greer, Ricky Otero. Now these ones are cool. These are the sporting news. Mickey Mandel. Yeah, this one's centered. Except for a little, I don't know, it's a little bit off. Same thing like the recent ones. Where it's got info on the back. So we're looking at getting getting some gradable ones. Unless I want to go go for the nines. 
Actually, nines isn't bad. Row minus C. That's Alberto's dad. Uh, this one's Matthew Correro, Alex Sanchez, Mike Liberthal, Say Herrera, Hudler, Mike Blowers, Jeff DeMonico. That one is the, I guess it's just the symbol. Mark Langston, he had a pretty good career with the Angels. And after Langston, Abbott, um, I'm trying to remember some other guys. They had like four good ones at one point when they had, uh, they're one of the best teams, team pitching wise for a while. Or not for a while, but they were one of the top five for about, probably about five, six years, just consistency. There's Maisk, Stanovic, Alex Gonzalez, pretty good fielder. And there's another Stanovic. There you go, Hall of Fame, Berto. Ken Hill, Mondesi, Lance Johnson, Molitor, great player, Hall of Fame. Ray Lankford actually had a pretty good career. Mark Clark, Lynn Allen Hill, Norm Charlton. Uh, Pablo Ortega, Ronnie Sabrino. Ortega was up for a while, so Bruno, I cannot remember. Here's one of the prospect cards. Homer Bush, Felipe Crespo, and Jed Hansen. Homer played for a while. He was outfield in second, if I remember right. Felipe Crespo, I don't remember much. And Han Jed Hansen, he, he didn't play that much. He was only up for a while. Here goes the highlights. A lighter. We got, we got a cool, cool looking green one coming up. It's another Chris Hoyles, General Bar Barroa, Travis Fryman. He had a pretty good career with the Tigers. I liked him. I was a big, grew up being a big Tiger fan. General Barroa. Got a couple good cards in this one. Jimmy Key, Daryl Bell, Tewksbury, and what is this? This is a coded. Interleague matchup. National League. This is Jeff Bagwell and John Jaha. So Jaha, he was a pretty good slugger at the time. Bagwell, well, Bagsy. Everybody knows Bagsy. He's in the Hall of Fame. Yeah, big good old Bagsy. So those are the ones. That's another set you want to try to get. So that's a good. That's a good card. There's some other bigger names, like the Griffey one and so on, but obviously you take what you can get, you never know. Justin Thompson, Kevin Elster, he played a long time. Decent fielder, I think he was like a 270, 270, 280 hitter. Hudley, he played actually a long time because he had a big bat with power, so he so he came off the bench more later in his career. Jim Leiritz, it's kind of the same thing. Australian Hitchcock, give up home runs. Mel Rojas, Luis Castillo is a pretty good player. Ah, this is number 42. This is one of the big cards to get in the set. So that's a pretty good one. And that one, same two. So it's like the top to bottom on, on most of these seem like they're, they're on these inserts are off. So this one makes it top to bottom. Left to right makes that off, off center. But it's card number 42. But that is one of the ones to get in the set. So I'll make some side cams on some of these and we'll see what see what I what I feel like sending in. It's Jimmy Key, John Valentine, Jose Valentine, John Valentine, Valentine roll. It's not in February yet. Andre Galarraga, pretty good player for a long time. Jim Edmonds, pretty good player for a long time. Gold Glover. Armando Reynoso is a home run king. Given up, that is. Dan Wilson. Greg Myers. Brad Klontz. Jose Offerman. Played for a long time. 
Actually, was pretty good at defense. Actually, was horrible at defense. He got pretty good at defense, but he always had speed. That was one of his assets. Uh, Wally Joyner played for a long time. I remember him with the Angels back when Langston and, and Jim Abbott and everybody. Turk Wendell, pretty good. He had a few good years. If I remember right. All right, we got some prospect cards from God Bobby Chenard. All right, let's see the prospects are. We got Glendon. Rush, Jared Washburn. He went around for a while. He came up through the Angels. Mark Wilkins he was a backup for a while. Uh, Mike Cameron actually played had a decent little career. Raul up by um, Ibanez and Jeff Jenkins. All three of them actually played for a while and had a pretty good little career. All right, so pack eight. What we got here? We got Elmer, kind of good one. He was a little speed guy. He reminds me of, of a Hamilton nowadays. William Van Lingham, kind of good one. Joey Hamilton. Here we go. Harold Baines, Hall of Famer. Billy Wagner with the cup. That's pretty cool. Uh, Butchudski, Orlando Miller. Julio Franco, great career. Mike Greenwell, he actually has uh, batting cages set up in the gaming room and uh, I think go-karts, like 10 minutes from me. Uh, Reggie Sanders had a pretty good career. Remember it was between Reggie Sanders and um, Eric Davis, Just they were just multi-tool guys. All right, so we got here Scott Rowland, had a really good career. I think Philly's Hall of Fame, I think. Um, Brian McRae, David Wells. Yeah, some of these guys had great careers they produced. Um, I think Rowan was on the one that they won. I think he was there when with Ryan Howard when they won. Um, but a lot of the older teams have some great history. He's Grissom, Speed, Mediocre Power, Glavin, Hall of Fame, Grissom, yeah, Jason Kendall, remember that when he came up, that's Rookie Cup, um, but that was pretty good, he was pretty good for a long time, Wilson Alvarez, lefty, I remember that all day, Lando Miller, oh, there we go, that's another good one, Willie Mays, that's a pretty cool picture. Pretty cool picture of him. Like I said, there's a subset for Maze and Mantle, so you'll get some of these cards in here. I just gotta see which ones that, that I think have a chance at a 10 and then send them in. Randy Myers, Wally Joyner, he had a great career. Kevin Brown, played a long time, had a lot of 15 plus winning seasons. Brad Klontz. Actually, I think Kevin Brown would be his Hall of Fame. Um, Jose Offerman. Oh, we got two cards. There. Troy O'Leary. There's another Jack Corruption. This one's better centered than the other one. Yep, those are nice cards. And not last but not least, David Heyman and Ron Hartman. I uh, have no idea. They probably came up, made a few at bats, and we're gone. Because I remember a lot of these guys from my era here. General Broa, Andy Ashby, J. Bell, Ashby, John Franco. Harnish. Yeah. Ooh, because that's an insert one too. Ah, oh, and it killed it. It stuck too much. Peeled it off the back. Ain't that a bummer? 
Yeah, that was a uh, Gary Sheffield All Star. Can't even put that into a. Yeah, pulled it right up. You can see it right there. There, where the tip of my finger is. And stuck up top a little bit too. Yeah, that's a shame on that one. So, and those cards were thinner foil too. So that makes it makes it harder. Jay Buhner, King Griffey Jr.'s best friend. Bruce Ruffin, Reggie Sanders, Arthur Rhodes, Greenwell, Dunstan, a pretty good career. Martin Comer, Scott Rowan again. Yeah, they um watching a thing, uh, King Griffey Jr. highlights in his Hall of Fame speech last night, and that was, that was pretty cool. That's he gave a lot of props to his dad and his kids were his final that made him come home kind of thing Sheffield Sheffield Lansing Tartar Ball so most of this box seems fine except for some here's another one. Oh, this is a Yankee uh, peel a little bit off Darn it, peel it right off right here. So, at least in this box, it might not be every box, but it's peeling off a little bit of the, little bit of the foil. Darn it, that's a shame. Any wall? Glenn Hill, Cordova, Linkford, Shuey, Josh Garrett, Chris. Rizma, for Percival, there's a draft pick, uh, Darrell Brown, Eric Milton. Milton actually had a decent career. Uh, I remember him most with Minnesota. Yeah, this one wants to play. All right. Jason Kendall again, Alvina, Stanley. He actually had a big bat. Played for a long time. Um, Alvina King, Metallico, Farland. There's another Willie Mays. Yeah, same thing. That one's off center. It must be this. However, they set up to, the, to cut these inserts were on the same because most of these other cards are fine. Just the inserts are the ones that were off. Oil ones actually looked pretty centered. Also, so Biggio. Who didn't like Biggio back then? Biggio is kind of like an Altuve right now. Ironically, same spot. Lay Ritz, Brantley, Elster, Cirillo. We had a good bat for a long time. Prospects Dante Powell, Billy McMillan, and Bubba Trammell. A lot of hopes with Bubba Trammell. He never panned out. Doug Million, Damian Moss, and Bobby Rogers. Yeah, back then they, they didn't do a good job at figuring out the prospect photos. <laughs> Most of those guys didn't make it. Nowadays, actually, a lot of the prospect pictures they take are... Uh, actually, most of those guys actually make it. Do what they're supposed to do. There's Grissom. There we go. Bogsy. Yeah, gotta love Bugsy. Ron Gant had a really good career. Uh, solid outfielder, speed, power. Has 20, 30 home run seasons, a bunch of them. Bugsy. Justice. There's another Biggio. Tony Phillips. John Randa. John, or Joe Randa, the cup. Captain Monaco, Roberto Perez, Francisco Cordova. He had a couple, actually, really, a couple really good years. Loretta, Eric Young, Steinbach, prospects. Kevin Brown, the Rangers. Ben Davis actually he did all right. Bobby Estella, Estalila. All three of them actually did pretty good. Actually stuck around for a while.
We're halfway done with the box here. Try to go a little faster for you guys. Velarde, Smiley, Velarde, Greg Jeffries. He's one of those woulda, coulda, shoulda. Just didn't pan up to being like a top pick. Um, but he was still a good player. Karkovice, Donnie Wall. There's another Willie Mays. This one actually looks halfway decently centered. Luckily, these aren't sticking. Yeah, that one actually looks pretty decently centered. Just a little bit off left or right, but not much. All right. Uh, Thomas Howard. Huddler. There we go. Mr. Piazza. One of the best hitting catchers. Him and Johnny Bench of all time. They were awesome catchers. Rex Huddler. Wilson, Nixon, and Roberto Perez. There we go. That's what we got here. One, two, three, four, eight, nine. Alright, Justice, Alex Gonzalez, Pedro, Alex Gonzalez, Ozzy Gian, his coach, and uh, Matt Meisk, Roger Pavlik, Percival, Charles Nagy actually had some really, really good years. Cleveland just somehow just they seem to come up with the pitching over the years. It's part of their farm system. And Hill, Blowers, Cordova, Steinbeck. Yep, two of them. Yep, there's one that had some bright spots. John Burkett. But well, he didn't pan up to where he should have been. Draft picks, Jermall Brown, Melton. Highlights, Dwight Gooden. Jeffries, Fryman, John Barry, Fryman, Kevin Apier. He actually had a pretty good career. Got injured often, uh, often later in his career, but it was uh, early in his career. But yeah, he actually he was like a late boomer. Herb Perry, another Willie Mays. I think there was like 17 of Mays and 17 of Mantle or something like that. Maze is the prime one in this set. Mantle's more the series two, if I remember right. But good cards, just off center, so I gotta be choosy when I send them in and get graded. Uh, Brantley. Bayritz. Hansen. Conine. My son's in the minors right now. Uh, we're taking Sabrino again. Percival. Prospects for the new one. Uh, Jim Benici, Sean Casey, Dimitri Young. Dimitri Young actually didn't do that bad. If I remember right, he went to uh, was either overseas or somewhere and actually had a pretty good career. Um, Sean Casey, he was a starter for a while, but yeah, he, had, he was a good bench guy for a long time. I'll move these back. Yeah, Dimitri Young. Remember him? He was an All Star a couple times. Um, because he had a, like I said, he had a good bat. Bogsy. Edmonds, Ricky. Edmonds. Higginson. Becker. Maggie. Raphael. Chris Nopick. Rillo, Ken Caminiti, great player in his own. Norm Charlton, Jim Leyritz, Wilson, Brian McRae, who's a pretty good fielder, good, good leadoff man. Bisquail,
All right, let's see what we got here. Getting close, guys. Got more mantles and maze than I thought. Just, just those uh, the, those silver cards are the ones that kind of blew it for me. Howl, Gilkey, Prapoon, Bell, Albert Bell, Jasmine, Pettit, Mike Moeller, John Dunstan, Reggie Jefferson, Sterling Hitchcock. I just remember him giving up tons of home runs at the wrong time. Reggie Sanders, looks like I liked him back in the day. Prospects, Cameron, Abanis, and Jeff Jenkins again. And Bush Crespo Hansen, Todd Jones. And six packs left. Almost there, guys. See if we can't get another one of these silver cards, but. But in good shape. Alright, Brett Boone, Jay Bell, had a pretty good career. Pregnazzi, same thing. Gary Gaetti. Had a pretty good career. Bro actually had a couple big years. There we go. Off center thing. Frankie, Frank Thomas. Loved loved Frank. Ready Jansen, Pettit. Julio Franco, Greenwell, Turk Wendell, Hanneman. Roland, Frank Rodriguez, uh, Tegan Sabrino again. All right, Bobby Higginson, Tom Glavin, Wilson, Glavin again. Johnson, Janovic, Garrett Anderson. Actually, he was a pretty good player for a while. Can't remember how many All Stars he went to, but he could hit. Pretty good fielder too. John Eisenreich. Same thing with him. Um, Terrell, Ray, Terrell Wade. Offerman. Brett Klontz. Grace. Wally Joyner. Remember that? I lived in L.A. During that time, is Wally World. <laughs> Matthew Cordero, Sanchez, Burkett, Larry Rodriguez, and Vladimir Nunez. Diamondbacks. Don't remember either one of those guys. All right, last four guys. Insert this one. Might be one of those silver ones. Hopefully, it doesn't. Uh, that stick, good. Edmonds, Tartar Ball, Valentine, Tartar Ball, Carlos Garcia, Fetters, Terrell Wade. Ah, here we go. This one didn't stick, thank God. Mark Grace, Cubs legend. I don't know about legend, but he was one of the one of the top ones. Remember that Sandberg Grace. Beautiful card. Yeah, then I'll probably send in because that one came out clean and yeah. If you look at center, a little bit off center, left to right. I might send it in just to see see if it goes through the cracks. Rob Nen, Grace, Shane Andrews, utility guy for a long time. Prospect cards, like some of these prospect cards didn't didn't do much at all. The best ones in the series too. This is the Chavez card. Oh, there we go, Hall of Fame, Edgar. All right, Durham, Presco, Wetland, Presco, Avery, love Avery. Here he was. I was sure more for Avery than Glavin. There's Mark Gracie. Had it. JT Snow. Those are different cards. Eric Owens. Hitchcock. Bernard. 
Dunstan, all those first few were. <laughs> Elster. All right, Robert Nunez, Langston, Nick Beerbrot, Kevin Sweeney again. I think that was the first one we got. Two packs left, guys. Thank you all for staying with me for this. I appreciate it. Like I said, Series 2 is going to be fun because that's got some of the refractors and the finest stuff in it, too. So that one's going to be a fun one. Uh, Avery, Smiley, there we go. Schmaltzy. Smiley, Ken Hill, Ashby, Portugal, Ishmael Valdez, Keotero, Josh Herrera, Nibethaw, Shui, Hollingsworth with the cup. He was great when he first came up. Uh, Gabe Alvarez, Aaron Boone, Kevin Ori. Ori would, did okay for a while. Alvarez did okay for a while. But Aaron Boone actually was a pretty good one. Powell, and this one, Bubba Trammell, Buner. Last pack, guys. Ah! Last pack, Bumble Mojo. Here we go. I'm going to get another Mantle. Maze, or am I going to get another insert? It's Garcia Gant, Ellis Burks. Actually, I liked him coming up too. <coughs> you got a Grissom. Um, Joy Cora, coach. Oh, yeah. Last pack mojo. That's a good one again. Actually, really good. Ken Griffey Jr. Sweet Strokes. Beautiful looking card. Beautiful looking card. Yep. Beautiful looking. Great looking card. And a Marky Mark. McGuire. Charlton Loretta. Cerillo. Langford, Buner, uh, Carrero, and these guys. Okay. Let me go through real quick. Couple, got a couple highlight cards that came in them. Dwight Gooden, Lighter, Mabry. All right, let me put these aside. So let's look at Willie Mays. Here's some inserts we got. So that's pretty cool. So that was, that's a pretty good batch for the inserts for them. Mantle. I like that card. That's actually a pretty good center too. So gonna, this one's off a little bit top to bottom. Mantle and Yogi Berra. Pretty cool card. The Sporty News. It's always kind of a classic. They did them was it this year or last year also. Um, got a couple of the Jackie Robinson cards. These are one of the cards to get in this. This one's really off center if you look at it. Compared to the other one. So this would this would be the this other one would be the one I might might on that one send in. Um we got the one has a, it's a finest. It's the interleague matchup. This one's Jeff Bagwell and John Jaha. This, so this is a pretty cool card. It's got the coding and everything. And then this one, we had three of these. Sweet Strokes. We had, uh, which these are pretty, pretty cool. Foil. A little bit thinner cards. Um, Mark Grace, Albert Bell, and obviously I love this one. Ken Griffey Jr. Beautiful looking card. And then we had these, but these are no good. These actually stuck to the back, which is a shame. All star cards, first team all star, so it says first team. And that was the Andy Pettit. 
and the Gary Sheffield but they're all stuck down and pulled the paper this one pulled just pulled it straight some pieces straight off so that was a bummer on that one I know on that set just didn't just didn't happen you know, and we had our list of our Batch of Hall of Famers and our Batch of Commons. All right, so thank you everybody for joining. And uh, I'll be doing Series 2 here shortly, and then I'll also have Series 2, uh, the 93 Stadium, 92 Stadium Club I'm doing. I already did um, box number one. So if you want to like, subscribe, check it out. I appreciate it, and we will see you later.